My name is Clay Watson, Safe Access Solutions Manager here at Huber Technology. We're here today on our manufacturing floor in Denver, North Carolina, so please excuse the noise. I'm here to talk to you about our stainless steel TT7 pressure door. Many of you know Huber Technology through our 150 years of experience with mechanical and biosolid equipment in the field of water and wastewater. However, the last 50 years, we've also been selling pressure doors. Huber is known for its stainless steel, and these pressure doors are no exception. In this field, we deal a lot with aggressive atmospheres, and our 304 and 316 stainless steel construction provides top-notch corrosion resistance. Every part on this door is put through a pickling bath and then passivated before assembly. This gives our products a longer life expectancy, higher strength, better hygiene properties, and better water tightness on these pressure doors. The model you see here is our TT7Z. It's rated up to 10 meters of water pressure. In some circumstances, we can get up to 15. A uh, key feature here is the central wheel lock. Uh, we also have a TT7, which is the exact same door, but with lever locks in the corners and in the middle. We also have a TT7R, which is the round version of this door, rated up to 10 meters. We have a TT7.30, which is this door rated up to 30 meters of water pressure. And we also have a TT6, which is solely used for flood protection, rated up to 2 meters. We offer two frames on these doors. The one you see here uh, is used for embedding into new concrete. Uh, we also have a frame that can be retrofitted to existing concrete and bolted around the outside. We have a variety of options that, that we can include on this door. Uh, as you see here, we have an inspection window, primarily used for drinking water tanks. Uh, we also include a sampling valve, condensate drain, underwater spotlight, uh, we offer these doors in uh, standard sizes, but we can also custom size to any, anything you need. Uh, and these doors, like I mentioned before, are available in 304 and 316 stainless steel. Tanks must remain accessible even after commissioning. And the main benefit of this door is the ground level access. Uh, it's safer, it's easier to access, and it offers reduced cleaning requirements. Access at the water level creates increased construction cost when heavy tools and equipment have to be carried up and down a ladder or lowered down by a crane. We use these doors for a number of applications. Uh, one application is drinking water. Um, so a key thing about drinking water is we are NSF and ANSI certified, uh, which means all parts in contact with water are free of contaminants. Uh, above ground tanks need side access doors at the ground level. We also use this door in wastewater, mainly digesters. Uh, it's, it's our most common application that we've seen here in the U.S. Uh, and our stainless steel will hold up to the most aggressive atmospheres. Another application is stormwater. Underground stormwater tanks need to be accessed from time to time for inspection and cleaning. Here's an example of an installation on an underground stormwater tank. Another application is flood protection, which is a growing problem here in the U.S. And our TT6 door is perfect for flood protection for industrial and municipal applications, such as protecting expensive VFDs and municipal pump stations, electrical rooms for hospitals, office buildings, data centers, airports, and prisons. If you're interested in one of these TT7 doors, please go to hubertechnology.com, click on stainless steel pressure doors, give us some information about your application, and we'll get back to you immediately.